Shalom guys, what's up? The Commodore 64 is one of the best 8-bit computers ever made. It also holds the Guinness World Record as the best-selling computer of all times. Huge library of games and demos from the 80s all the way to present day, where new games are released even now in 2020. All good and great, however, there's one major challenge. Loading games from tape images is a nightmare and can take a long time even 20 minutes or more. Loading games from a floppy drive, or in the case of the Mister, a floppy-based image, which are represented as D64 files, can take several minutes. Same speed issue is relevant to a real C64, device emulator, and in our case, the Mister. There are several speed loader solution available. Among these are the Final Cartridge, Epix Fast Load, and one of the most famous in the Commodore community, Jiffy DOS. Setting up Jiffy DOS in the Mister can be a bit tricky, so I thought a short video guiding you throughout the setup process can help. The idea of the video is to demonstrate loading a game from a floppy image, in this case one of the latest releases of the beloved Bruce Lee game, the new Bruce Lee Return of Fury that was released in 2019. We will start with a regular C64 kernel, measuring load time, then I will guide you how to set up Jiffy DOS using Windows. The same process is relevant to Mac and Linux as well. Once done, I'll configure the Mister to use the updated Jiffy DOS kernel, and then we will load the game again and measure the load time to show the huge difference between the default kernel and Jiffy DOS. Hope you'll find it useful. Let's see the road. Enjoy!